Hi, my name is Tim Lotzenheiser, and I'm the Vice President of Education for Con Selmer. I'm probably in your band room or your auditorium right now visiting with you, and you're coming up to one of the most important decisions of your life that will impact your child greatly. Uh, I'm sure you're trying to decide, should Jeff or Sarah be in band or not be in band? And what we look at initially is, oh, the cost of the instrument or the amount of time it's going to take. I'm here to talk about some other parts that you might want to consider. I want to talk about the educational benefits. I want to talk about the emotional benefits. And I want to talk about the economic benefits. There's a ton of empirical research out there that says when children are part of the arts, specifically music, there are advantages in every other part of their total development, particularly their school life. So for many years we said all the smart kids are in music, but we know something different. We know that music actually makes them the smart kids. So the educational benefits from a child being in band or choir or orchestra far outweigh just the musical ones. Now, I'm a musician, so I want them in there because of the intrinsic joy that comes from it. That's the emotional part, that we can say with music what we can't say with words, that it itself is a special pleasure in doing it. You know, young people, well, I guess old people too, are going to express themselves in many ways. If I were lucky enough to be a parent, I want my son or daughter to be around the best kids in the school. Guess where they are? They're hanging out in the band room. The life skills that they learn through band, they can adapt to anything and everything they do. Teamwork, cooperation, the ability to get along with other people, going the extra mile, dedication, commitment, all of those wonderful terms that we know are the foundation for success. So let's talk about the economical part. Well, first of all, if you're a decent player and you go to college, you're probably going to get a scholarship and you don't have to be a music major to do it. So there's one there. When we look at very successful business people and we see their background, over 80% of them have been involved in music at one time of life. Now, I want them to make music forever. But even if they don't, the sense of appreciation is there and the support of the arts is there and that's what will lift them to a higher level in everything they do. So if you're sitting there going, why band? Maybe the question that begs the answer is, why not band? So I'll tell you what, this is an incredibly important decision. And it only happens once. We know that if people don't learn music in schools, very few of them will take it on later in life. So the decision you're making now has an impact on your child forever. Please think it through carefully. Please know it's going to make a huge difference. Thank you for letting me have the time with you. And let's strike up the band. Let's talk about the benefits to you as a band parent. Um, you know, I love sports. I love everything about sports. Uh, but in sports, if we're a parent, we sit and watch the child. If we're a band parent, we participate. It's a family affair. I gotta tell you a great story. One of the things I do in the fall is I get hooked up in this crazy marching band competition and they do them all over the nation. And my job at these little events is I go over and I meet the band when they show up and then I help them get on the field and get started and get all the props set and all that sort of thing. So several years ago, I'm in Houston, Texas. It's like 120 degrees, which makes no sense having the smartest kids in the school standing on AstroTurf, 120 degrees. But anyway, so I'm helping them get everything all set and there's this one band dad that is running around with the timpani trying to know where it goes, you know? And he's, I don't know where to go, I don't know where to go. And finally, I got him calmed down, and I said, what's going on? Oh, I don't want to put the drum in the wrong place if I get a penalty on, and all this sort of thing. So I said, it's, you're fine right there. 
you're going to be fine. Now tell me, is it your son or your daughter? Oh, it's my son, and he's a percussionist, and I'm so nervous. And I said, well, you just stand right back here, and you enjoy this, right? So I go over to the other side to get the band, and the band director is laughing. He says, do you have any idea who you were talking to? And I said, yeah. I said, it's one of your band dads. He said, he's an astronaut. Well, I never met an astronaut, so I got to get his autograph, right? So anyway, we finish, and I go back over to see this gentleman to get his autograph, right? And he comes running, and we give each other a hug, and, it's a, and I said, you're an astronaut. And he goes, yeah, so what? Well, I said, what are you doing out here? <laughs> oh, you're, shouldn't you be, like, sequestered someplace for the big flight? And he just looked at me, and he started crying. He said, I'm doing the most important thing in my life. I'm supporting my son. And it was one of those <gasps> aha moments when you go, yes, the most important thing in our lives is to support our children and make sure that their lives are happy and prosperous. Not going to happen any better place than the culture of that band room. Hope you'll join us.